Hello guys, we're gonna go ahead and see if the Mavic 2 Zoom 2.0 track the Tello drone micro level. What I'm saying is a smallish drone. We're gonna go ahead and see if it can actually, the active track work on this guy here. Now you guys can see, um, I'm actually trying it out, <laughs> doing the active track 2.0 on the Mavic by using this uh, feature um, on the Tello. And you can see here, um, I actually can track it down, but you guys are gonna go ahead and see <laughs> what else it can do. Um, you can see here, move a little bit, now I lost the object now is back again and um i'm gonna show you guys here and it's actually following it down and it's actually sh again like i said it loses the object i mean like i said maybe the mavic 2 still need more few more updates for the active track 2.0 but you guys can see over here lost me here and the cool thing about it is it can actually track while it's flipping <laughs> You can see here the Tello is actually being caught on the, see that? So that's a cool object and you can see here, I mean, never been done before, active track on especially in a small object and you can see the Mavic Zoom can still manage to track down the Tello. And I'm gonna do a few more flips here and you guys can see and um and you guys can also see i'm actually um it can actually follow it all the way up but like i said it will not follow it all the way where the tello is going and it's staying in one area i think like i said maybe it's gonna help with the more updates coming up soon with this uh 2.0 um active track from and um now I think you guys can see it again. Like I said, if you guys are going to do this, uh, especially using Active Track right now in this moment, I've been, if you guys have not seen my video, I've been um, doing lots of uh, Active Tracking on, on this uh, 2.0 on Mavic Zoom. And if you don't have the transmitter with you while you're doing Active Track, it's a little bit dangerous. So if you are, like I said, if if you guys are doing this or you're walking or you're running or you're riding your bike or you're riding your scooter motorcycle name it if you have the you know if you have the chance to bring along with you the controller bring it because it's like I said um, with this active track 2.0 feature it's still new and it if it did not track you or anything like that, I mean, it's still dangerous. Um, like myself using it on the water sports and you know, it works, but still, cause I don't have the transmitter with me and something happens like this, it can, you know, like, I mean, more chances you have obstacle avoidance all around, but still, you know, <laughs> this thing moves so fast and things could happen. But like I said, like you guys can see here what I'm doing now and again you guys can go ahead and enjoy the watching this video and like I said and go from here and also guys forgot to mention um, the obstacle avoidance does work you guys can see here and this is the smallest object <laughs> and you can see the active track can still I'm sorry the um, obstacle avoidance still works and you can see it from here but anyway again Go watch this video and like I said, and thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share and go from here and see for more.